Hello again, Dominic Trofer, and welcome to another video. And uh, this is actually going to be something Doctor Who related. Now, I know I've not done anything Doctor Who related in a while, but especially with this recent news, um, I wanted to do a video. Uh, now, today, I'm actually going to be uploading two videos. Um, this Doctor Who one, I was going to do it yesterday, but I, obviously I didn't do it. I thought, well, um, you know, I could do it today and do my, you know, my new video uh, tomorrow, and I thought, well... I want to do the two videos today, so you'll be getting two videos today, and um, I um, hope you enjoy this one, and then I'll be doing my other one very shortly. But anyway, this one's going to be a bit of a short video, and uh, this one is actually about uh, some news we got yesterday for Doctor Who, which is that, um, which is going to be that um, the announcement of the 13th Doctor. Um, yesterday, um, there was, uh, like a trailer clip, if you want to think like that, that was shown, and it, um, just showed different areas around places, uh, and it showed, like, you know, the TARDIS key, uh, getting, like, elect um, electric and stuff, um, um, something going on, but everywhere had the number 13 on it, which means, obviously, the 13th Doctor. And uh, my thoughts about is I'm looking forward to seeing what it is that we get tomorrow. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing who it is. Um, for the people for people who think, you know, who would I like to see? Honestly, I'm not really, really bothered who I'd love to see. I think anyone who plays the role really, really well. And I'm excited to see who the next person to play the Doctor uh, will be. Uh, like I said, I know we've got a few months... You know, until Peter Capaldi leaves, because technically he's still the current current uh, incarnation. Um, but overall, I think with Peter Capaldi, I will be sad to see him leave because he has done you know so much tremendous stuff in Doctor Who. You know, he's had a lot of good points and he's had a lot of bad points uh, that's happened throughout his tenure. And you know, I I think for what he's given us for these almost four years has been absolutely tremendous. You know, series ten overall, well so far. Uh, episodes 1 to 12 have been amazing, really, really good, and I cannot wait to see what we get in the Christmas special. Um, but yeah, overall, um, like I said, we're getting the announcement of the 12th, uh, 13th Doctor, sorry, um, after the uh, Wimbledon match. Um, but thinking about it, I don't understand why they always announce Doctor Who during sports events. I really, really don't understand why they do that. But um, in a way, I just wanted to, you know, give my little points about this, about it. I'm looking forward to seeing what we get, um, you know, who the 13th Doctor is, he or she, whoever it is. Um, and I welcome this person, you know, to, the, um, you know, the line of Doctors. So um, if you are interested, I, I hope you look forward to it. And I will be doing a video about my thoughts of the new incarnation or the new actor, actress or whatever. Uh, this Sunday coming tomorrow. So I was going to say thank, thank you very much for watching this quick video and I'll be doing my main video very shortly after this, okay? Which I will upload obviously later on afterwards. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. See ya. Bye.